Can there be a middle? <laughs> All right. No. Gotta yes. pick a side. Pick a side. I don't know which side to pick. Don't hate me, guys. I, I don't. I almost went there too. It's like I it's think so like hard. guiltily, like I'm like happy that I'm not oppressed, but I'm not proud of like things people have done in the past. When I when I think of being proud of something, I think of something I worked for. Or that um, yeah. I, yeah, I had to get, I, I had to do nothing to be white. Mm -hmm. Absolutely nothing. And nothing was taken from me because I was white. It's like saying, I'm a proud white person is a completely different saying than saying, I'm a proud black person. Because when you hear, I'm a proud black person, I think empowerment, I think yeah. strength, I think courage, I think, you know, all these amazing things that the black community has done and accomplished throughout the years. But then when you say, I am a strong, or I'm a proud white person, Already, there's so much like hate yeah. involved in that. The thing about that is like, like how you said, someone who says I'm proud to be black, that's empowerment. Why aren't I allowed to be proud to be white? Thank you. What thank you. That, that I was waiting. Uh, thank you. That was I was waiting on that. I was bro because first of all, this is the thing. First of all, <laughs> you shouldn't even be proud of just the skin color that you are. Now, white, black, bro, it don't matter. It, it, bro, y'all need to stop with the whole race thing, the whole color thing. Like, bro, that does not matter. That seriously does, ma does not matter. All the people, I can't tell if this side is agree. I, I think it's agree. And then this side is disagree or whatever. I don't know. All I, all I can say is that you should never be proud of just the skin color that you are. You should always be proud of the achievements that you have uh, accomplished, everything that you have done throughout your life. You know what I'm saying? You should be proud of that. It shouldn't even be no, oh, I'm proud to be black. Like, like yes, I'm proud of my color, the color of my skin, but it's just not the color of my skin. I'm proud because I'm 19 with my own crib. I'm proud I'm 19 with my own car. I'm proud I'm 19 with two sources of income. Like, that, that's the things I'm proud of. Being young and being able to achieve all these things, that's what I'm proud of, not because I'm black. You know, so I don't even know why she's in the middle even saying, oh, well, um, I don't know because I, I, I mean, I... I'm glad that I'm not oppressed. Just a whole bunch of bull, bro. A whole bunch of bull. Some of you white people just need to be bold. Y'all need to really be bold, bro. Y'all be so, some of y'all be so scared to get canceled. Y'all be so scared to get canceled. Y'all feel like y'all say the wrong thing. A black person gonna cancel y'all. At the end of the day, you can't cancel the truth. You know what I'm saying? Be proud of who God created you to be. Y'all, man, we live in America, bro. And I feel like everybody should be proud of who they are as a person. Who their what their characteristics are. We all should be proud of that, not just the color of our skin. Like makes it wrong. You been oppressed. Yeah, what are you proud of? Just your skin color? Because yes, that is wrong. So you're so saying I, I, I can't be proud to be white because I don't have a culture. No, I <laughs> that's not what I'm saying. I, that I, when white people say they're proud to be white, a lot of times, at least in my opinion, they're just they're talking about their skin color, that they're not a different race. Why why is that why is that though? Why, why is that? Why is that when white people say they're proud to be white, they got to be talking about their skin color. But when black people say they're proud to be black, they're not talking about their skin color. I'm just kind of confused because it, it seems like it's a lot of contradicting going on. Because trust me, when half of the black community say, oh, I'm proud to be black, they're just speaking on their skin color. Not a lot of people speak on the characteristics, the, the uh, how powerful they are as a person. Like Not a lot of people speak on that. If I say I'm proud to be this person, I feel like, okay, the question should have been rephrased. Are you proud to be who you are as a person? I feel like that should have been the question. Why I got to be, are you proud to be white? Why are you proud to be black? Like at the end of the day, if you say it like that, obviously you're going to be speaking on just the color of your skin. Black people say I'm proud to be black. What are they speaking on? The color of their skin, right? White people, same thing. What are they speaking on? The color, but it's funny how it's always some bash towards white people when they say something like this. But when the black community say it, nobody cares. Y'all pick and choose what y'all want to truly care about. Y'all pick and choose what y'all want to be hypocritical towards. <laughs> I think that's wrong. Yeah. But um, as like we were talking about, as a proud black person, they've been oppressed. That a lot of their culture was stolen from them. And a lot of reasons that I don't like proud to be white is because it has the, the Nazis used it the, the the kkk used it i don't want to be associated with any of those things so i'm just gonna completely stay away from that sure i'm not proud of like what my culture has done but at the same time like i would not want to be anything else if i had to choose another race i don't know what i would be i'm okay with where i am even though i'm getting backlash about being white 
Bro, that is the bro, that is the best freaking statement I have heard. Let's replay that. I'm sorry. Right, let, let, let's come on, run it back for me. Run it back for me. Cause that that is the probably one of the best statements I have ever heard in my life. I have ever bro. I applaud this woman, bro. Proud of like what my culture has done, but at the same time, like I would not want to be anything else. If I had to choose another race, I don't know what I would be. I'm okay with where I am, even Thank though you. I'm getting Thank backlash you. about being white. Bro, that is beautiful. That right there is freaking amazing. You, bro, at the end of the day, what my what what the past what happened in the past with black people. You know what I'm saying? What happened in the past, even what white people have done to black folks. At the end of the day, I didn't live in the past and I can't change the past. All I can do is live in the present. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't matter. You should be proud of who God created you to be. It's like, bro, why should I not be, if I was white, why should I not be proud to, to, to be white? Why, why should I not be proud of that? Why? God created me like this, so why should I be proud of his creation? Because if I'm not proud of his creation, I'm basically just saying, God, you messed me up. And God don't make mistakes. You see what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, we all should be proud of the person that God created us to be. It's not about the color of your skin. I don't even want to look at the color of your skin. Just look at your achievements. Look at everything you accomplished in your life. That's the things you should be proud about, not the color of your skin. The color of your skin, this is all just a flesh. This is all flesh, bro. Because when we die... Well, seriously, when we die, all this right here, this, look, this is burning. Flesh, no, what's inside of you is what's going to live. That's your spirit. You know what I'm saying? All this flesh, this is all burning. All these tattoos, I got, all that's gone. So it's all within what's inside of you, bro. Not the color of your skin. God didn't look at, Jesus didn't look at the color of your skin when he died on that cross. So we got to realize that, bro. And with and with the whole black people, uh, uh, black people should be proud to be black. Well, they they say they're proud to be black because they've been through so much. Their culture been through so much. Culture been taken away from them, and they've been oppressed, bro. At the end of the day, like I said, nobody lived through all the stuff that happened back then. You know what I'm saying? My grandparents, they don't even talk about what happened back then. They just proud to be here today. They proud of what America came to today. You know what I'm saying? They proud they can go into the same store as a white person and not really be judged. You know what I'm saying? Now, granted. It's a lot of racist people out there, but you're not born racist. You're taught to be racist. You you taught to be racist. It's what's in the household. So at the end of the day, bro, I'm proud to be who I am. I'm, I'm proud of my skin color too, but I'm not even looking at the race. I'm proud to just be the pan TV. I'm proud of that. That's what we should all be proud of. So let me know in the comment section below. Are you proud to be the person that you are? And let me tell you something else before I get off this video. This is one thing I want white people to understand. If you are scared to say something, if you you should never be scared to say something. The same thing that the black community say, you should not be scared to say. Because at the end of the day, like I said, you can't cancel the truth. So if you say that you're proud to be white, you better mean it. You better march it. You better do whatever you can, bro. At the end of the day, you're human. You are human. And you can't change what happened in the past. You just can't do it. You know what I'm saying? You didn't ask to be white. Just like we didn't ask to be black. So at the end of the day, it doesn't matter. Be proud of who you are. Y'all need to stand on it. Be proud of who you are. Be bold. Stop being scared because you might, because you might feel as you might get canceled. Who cares? Who cares? Cancel culture is a joke. They cancel what's the truth. They don't cancel what's not the truth. They just cancel what is the truth. That's what they do. They're a joke. So y'all let me know what y'all think about this video in the uh, comment section below. Sorry about the late upload, y'all. Your boy been busy today. But you know, I still had to get a video off of y'all, man. I love y'all. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace.